Good morning, Hawk Nation. It's November 21st, and I'm Davy Jacobs. And I'm Catherine Plummer, and welcome to PGTV. The, the Newsies, Newsies Takeover. takeover. Do you know where to find information on scholarships? Oh, please. My father owns the world. Yeah, well, a guy like me, I need a scholarship. I don't want to be selling newspapers the rest of my life. Luckily, though, the nice counselors here have made a website. What's a website? <laughs> anyway, these counselors put together one spot where you can find everything. And here's Hannah Dawson to tell you where to look. This year, the counselor for the seniors, Luann Smith, is going into classrooms talking to students about their plans for the future and even more importantly, scholarships and where to find them. And I encourage students, anytime you apply for any college, to go ahead and go to their specific website and do scholarship applications on the college websites. But for additional scholarships this year, Pleasant Grove has paid to be a part of eScholarships USA a website with information on many available scholarships. And if you'll go to this website, it has all of our local scholarships as well as scholarships from all over the United States. As always, Ms. Smith assures students that Any questions that they have, all they have to do is stop by our office and we'll be glad to help them. With PDTV, I'm Dawson Anderson. Well, with that information, maybe even a guy as broke as you can make it out to be a newspaper baron. <laughs> I don't know if I'd go that far, but in other news, the Pleasant Grove basketball teams have just started their season. Let's see how they're doing. I feel pretty good about it. You know, I think we got more shooters this year, so obviously uh, that helps out as a coach. So I feel like that'll, that'll make us a better team out. So we got, we got more kids we can make outside shots. That opens the lane up uh, from a ball and a I feel like we're going to be a good team this year. I feel like because everybody wanted this year. We got that dog mentality. I feel like people I step on the court with, people we step on the court with, we're going to play our hardest. This is the chemistry. Uh, we struggled last year once we got football kids in. And it just wasn't nothing negative toward anybody. We just we just struggled to jail as a team. And, and uh, I feel like we, we clicked a little bit better this offseason so far. And I feel like some better chemistry going on there. For PGTV, I'm Jay Stu. The Pleasant Grove film students have just finished up their first move-in picture for contest. Well, here's a clip from their first picture. <laughs> I'm the owner and, and the manager of the Falcon uh, Monster Mart. I've owned the place since 1983. I heard it back in high school. At a distance, I've seen one twice. You know, I didn't never question him seeing something, because I, I really believe he did. To see the whole thing, you can check out the uh, PGTV YouTube page. What's a YouTube? I couldn't tell you, but I could tell you that Thanksgiving is next week, which means no more work for me. And I already don't go to school. But it also means <laughs> it's a time to say thanks for the things we have. Here is Hannah and Noel with kids across the district letting us know what they're thankful for this year. What are you thankful for? My life. My dog. God and Jesus. Um, my friends and family. My family. What are you most thankful for? My family and football. I'm most thankful for my teachers. I'm thankful for my potatoes at home and my athletic I'm thankful for being healthy and safe. Basketball. What are you thankful for? My cats. I would have to go with uh, friends, family, and duck season. Chick-fil-A. I'm thankful for my family and that the Hawks are going to the playoffs. I'm thankful for my break from my father. Yeah, well, I'm thankful for a good headline. I'm also thankful for our Congress folks who just competed last week. 
On that note, Matthew Brannon will serve as an alternate for state and Jillian Knowles placed third and will advance to state in January. Also advancing to state, just a little sooner, is that sophomore Emma Hennard in cross country. She competes next week in Round Rock. And since we won't be in school to send her off the right way, here's something just for you, Emma. <laughs> Emma, we're so proud of you for making it to state in cross country. Hawk Nation is behind you and we're rooting for you. And we know you're gonna do great things as you represent the Pleasant Grove High School and the Pleasant Grove community. Good luck, Emma. Go Hawks. A football team takes on the Nevada Community Braves tomorrow at the Star in Frisco. Kickoff is at three. Let's get a little uh, jazzed for the game. We've been growing a lot the last five weeks and that's our message to the guys tonight is, you know, we've been taking steps and we're gonna continue to do that. team and our kids they have come out here and grinded the last three weeks and we always talk about we reap what we sow and I think that was a statement win tonight playing together offense and defense picking each other up um, and been dominating from the first play to the last play, so really, really proud. Don't forget to catch us, the Newsies, this weekend too. We had our first show last night. We have another one tonight and one on Sunday. And that's going to be all for this week. We hope to see you there at the theater. Now I got to run. I think my folks are calling me for dinner. <laughs> <laughs> Give us your best turkey call. Gobble, gobble, gobble. Gobble, gobble. Gobble, gobble, gobble. Gobble, gobble, gobble. Gobble, gobble, gobble. Gobble, gobble, gobble. Just go, gobble, gobble, gobble. Gobble, gobble, gobble. Gobble, gobble, gobble. Gobble, gobble, gobble. Gobble, 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 gobble. Give us your best turkey call. Wow! The curve! Cock a doodle doo. I'm thankful for a break coming up this week. <laughs> the newsies. The newsies take. I'm Michael McNeil. I'm Davy Jacobs. <laughs> Michael McNeil. And I'm Catherine Plummer. You can't be Michael McNeil. I'm sorry. I read it on the thing up there. <laughs> Ignore the thing. Ignore the thing. Ignore the thing. Ignore the thing.